Rosa and you are watching Beauty Break here on Clever TV and today I am doing the waterfall braid tutorial and if you guys have watched my channel before you might know that I did this video on my channel like eons and eons and eons ago circa high school awkward not so cute Megan but I thought I would come on here today to recreate and show you guys an even better updated fancier lovelier more amazing version and we're British now So you can do a waterfall braid on middle part, side part, whatever your little heart desires. But for me personally, uh, my middle part got a little bit sunburned, so we're gonna do the side part today. I'm gonna start by taking three sections, just like I would with any French braid, just from the front of my hair. And I'm going to do one full little braid. So cross across this one, cross across this one. And then, once we get to this section that is closest to the head, we're going to drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. And instead of crossing that back over, you're gonna take a section of hair from right here, which is right next to that section, and you're gonna pick that up and invite it to your braid party. Hey, join in the braid. Now we're going to cross over again, and then when you take the side that you cross from this side, we're going to grab some hair from the top section because it's kind of like a French braid on the top. So bring that to the party and we cross it over. And then again, every side that hits closest to the face, that piece of hair, you're going to drop that. Drop it like it's hot, drop it like it's hot. And again, taking a section of hair, similar size, just right next to it. We're gonna take that and cross that over into the braid. And again, crossing the farthest side over, grab a little bit of hair from the top as a French braid. Going that in the braid, and drop this part of the braid. And grab another section right here, braid that in. This is one of those hairstyles that's like practice makes perfect. It's gonna take you a while, but it's well worth it. It's really fun for prom and things like that because it looks a little more special and unique. And like your head's a waterfall. Like people are gonna see you and be like, is that a rainforest? Oh no, that's just Megan. So you can do a waterfall braid all around your entire head. But for me, I'm just going to stop right about here, just a little bit easier, and let's be honest, my arms are getting tired. I'm going to finish it off with the final section, and I'm just going to braid that down the rest of my hair. And at this point, this is just a normal braid. Woo! Start working out. Drink some green juice. Five hours later. I'm gonna secure this off with a clear elastic, so you could also use a ribbon, a bow, rope, brass, flowers, paper clip. Now I'm just going to go through and kind of touch it up so any pieces that started popping up, you can just pull through the little waterfall strands. Now if you have tons of pesky little flyaways like your homegirl right here, you're gonna wanna finish it off with a little hairspray. Okay guys, that is it. Your waterfall braid is done. It's super perfect for summer because it's heatless and you don't have to curl your hair or do anything. You can just braid it and sing Don't Go Chasing Waterfalls. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Okay. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and subscribe to Clever TV because every single Monday I will be back here doing another episode of Beauty Break. I'm Megan Rosette and I will see you all on the flip side. It's beauty break, I'm Megan, deuces. <laughs>